You know, it was the Trump guys or whatever. We did. Uh, was Trump guys or whatever? Uh, nah. Chombo. We nah, did. No, no. That last name so is the Chombo. I, can't now. So I, thought, I thought this ship was named the yeah. Chombo, and the That's ship, the, 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 the... Yeah. Oh, right. The other one was, was yeah, right. Okay. okay. I don't remember show. what it was called, but I remember that it was something. Oh, so it was, yeah. We definitely listened to you, though, Atlas. I wasn't saying anything important anyway, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. I never do. Yeah. Was, yeah. Outlast. The out. The outlast. <coughs> yeah. Uh, right. So, uh, we're just going to jump into this. Uh, so, we got our captain, uh, Jeff, playing as Captain Tiber. We got the the right hand man Felix playing Stan Crantham. We've got Driscoll playing as Axel, the pilot. Hello. And uh, that's it for the crew now. Uh, yeah, that's we robot, have apparently. <laughs> the... You got a lot of static on your audio there, Nat. I do. Weird. I don't know what that's about. You know what? That, that happens to me anytime I'm trying to pull my audio from my Skype feed into OBS. I have to actually put my um, microphone in as a source. How about that? Is that better? That's better. Okay, good. Uh, yeah, that's what it was, actually. I clicked the wrong, uh, unmuted the wrong thing. Okay, so uh, the Marines. We have Marines on board. Uh, vacationing Marines. And uh, that starts with our uh, Sergeant, uh, Adams, uh, Sergeant George Wildstar. We've got uh, Good Devil is uh, Corporal Dez, the medic. Good night. We've got Erm as Lance Corporal Ermageddon. He likes flamethrowers. Hello. That's not... <laughs> That's not wrong. That was after. <laughs> and then we've got uh, Bruce Gaskin as Private Rehnquist Vinter. The new He's holding guy. it with both hands. Yeah. And then we've got some uh, some some passengers on board. we got uh, Armand is playing uh, as Dr. Tevi Fonda. Uh, Baba Booey to you. And then a couple of NPCs. We have a big game hunter who's currently quarantined in a medical bay. Uh, his name is Hoopy. Uh, and then we have the um, marshal who is uh, in the uh, med bay with them. Uh, Shad Jenkins. And then missing is the supposed murderer, uh, Chloe. Um... Yeah, who wants to recap last week or anything that happened last week? Just fill these, oh, fill these people in in case they missed it. I have one thing that I'd like to yeah. throw in. That uh, Bruce Gaskin uh, and his private uh, grabbed the alien and held it out. And I had multiple opportunities of attacking and trying to cut it. And I failed and hesitated multiple times of actually trying to even cut it with these hedge clippers that I randomly pulled out of nowhere. stash. Yep. Hidden yes. stash. Yep. It's not but that on that the plane. That was in the ventilation room that uh, I accidentally locked ourselves <laughs> in. And uh, that's what we're dealing with now, on our end at least. That's on the top floor, um, because we were searching the top floor. Um, I know others were locked in the uh, uh, captain's mm -hmm. deck. Or they the were self-locked in, but but they're they're pretty much right below you, yeah. Yeah, I mean he. He broke the door, so it's sealed in with magnetic, magnetic locks, I assume. But it's still broken. Uh, yeah. And um, what about uh, another group? Where was the rest of you guys doing? 
right outside the, the captain or the command deck in that uh medical room. Uh, oh, the medical to room. Stay alive. Meanwhile, me and the soldiers are going crazy. Me and the sar uh, we're flipping me shit. Me and the sergeant just uh, turning uh, rooms head over heel, uh, <laughs> seeing if we can find this this goddamn uh, uh, convict that's on that's on the ship. Uh, we're not cleaning that shit up afterwards. No, hell no. That, uh, that, that they pay people for that. That's a big. <laughs> Such a problematic statement, right there. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. With my character. Shut up. <laughs> oh, we've got we've got uh, people in the chat uh, doing chow. Chow. How's their chow? Yeah, chow. I think I think they meant chaos, but it's I think somebody has uh, fat fingers on his keyboard. <laughs> I'm calling what? him out specifically. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm watching as he's reading the chat to try to figure out, is he talking about me? <laughs> is he talking about Please me? Please do chat. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Utter chow. Now it's going to be the running joke. Damn it. He was like, fuck. <laughs> All right. Oh, boy. Uh, I forgot that we didn't have our, uh, our map up there. So, yeah, that's the ventilation room there. Are um, we still going to continue... Combat, or are we, we are uh, gonna? We are gonna continue combat. Also, my other question. I'm sorry. You said one. Um, are you going to post the picture up in Skype as well? I will. Now you own that one. Uh, once we get. Sorry, started. you have to. You have to put all <laughs> questions in the form of writing, and they must be mailed and postmarked uh, four days <laughs> prior to the stream date. And then I'll notarize them. Never them ask any questions. <laughs> yeah. It's, that's we're, we're way going, too many rules for me. If I can't just one, uh, it's like the IRS. We're going Please Texas. Just do who would it? Sorry. Well, we're going Texas absentee <laughs> voter rules tonight, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah. So what about the captain and, and you guys? What were you guys up to? Well, last session. Um, we were, uh, <laughs> interrogating the marshal. Uh, my good friend, Tevi Fonda, gave me some, uh, some, some miracle elixir to keep us safe. Mm -hmm. Nothing they found. All four of them it. were the exact same. All exa exactly the same. Yeah. Nothing nefarious happens. He was... Wouldn't will willingly poisoned himself. Or yeah, I think else. I, I think I got um, something like that. I think I got like my beta saving throw that means I'm immune to everything. <laughs> and then uh, after that, we were went to the uh, the bridge and locked ourselves in to survey the goings on in the ship. I think we were watching the uh, Marines bigger <laughs> and. Uh, Yep. Yeah, they stuff. Went, uh, which leads us to the last group, which was uh, ripping the uh, the beds Not apart. The... Um, Some of the rain ransacking stuff. Some of them were being very nice and not throwing shit everywhere. But uh, I thought Axel kicked ass and uh, worked on the console to like make sure he was watching everybody. Mm -hmm. Right. Yep. They're watching the security footage. They're adding to uh, just, to just your transportation what? bill. Well, just for that that shit. Was... No. Um. <clears throat> <laughs> and uh, and good the, the good doctor. Let's. Uh, oh you? yes. So, Tevi Fonda performed an autopsy on Bucket. Um where he learned that uh, pretty much his specimens have uh, were responsible for, for the monster's infection. Uh, he then went to go check on them, where he was also infected, unfortunately. Uh, and then he uh, ventured up into the medical bay at the uh, request of the captain, the good captain, to check on Hoopy. Uh, unfortunately, Hoopy looks like he has made a turn for the worst. 
and I don't think he's going to make it. Um, and uh, in order to stave off the infection, uh, the good doctor whipped up four miracle elixirs and gave one to uh, himself, to the captain. Uh, I believe one, who who got who got the other one. I I, I know one of them went to that 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 smarmy fuck uh, Stan Crantham. Yeah. I think the colonial yep, there you go. That's the who one. it was. It was the Mar Shad Shad Jenkins. Is that correct? That is correct. <laughs> uh, so so yeah, he uh, he then spent the rest of the time in the um, medical bay, monitoring Hoopy uh, and trying to take as much medication as humanly possible to try to fight off whatever's growing inside. I'm gonna be a mommy, <laughs> which was seen by Axel. <laughs> Sorry, I just got it. <laughs> All right. You ready for your C-section? Yeah. What do they call a C-section when it's done from the inside? Well, it's done from the chest. That's why it's a, a C-section. For the chest. Ah, oh, there we go. Got it. C for chest. C is for chest. And cookies. Oh, I like cookies. But mostly for no really. Yeah. All right. So here's what we're going to do. Uh, we were in the middle of this combat thing going on here. Uh, and that was uh, the private. And it was Erm. And it was the... Uh, uh, what do they call it? The, uh, the Bloodburster. Right. Bloodburster. So, question-wise, uh, the models, mm -hmm. is uh, Bruce still laying down? I thought no, he, he was got standing up. and holding. Yeah, he got up. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Just, uh, sorry. We just never updated that because we were just in the middle of it. Um, Double fisting, correct? So what I'd also like to do is have uh, the other two Marines... Uh, uh, roll initiative. And, um, I guess just for the sake of it, we can have the captain and, uh, captain pilot and Felix, uh, roll initiative. Mm -hmm. Is that initiative dice uh, or card? The card's fine. I, well, actually, do the dice, do the dice. Yeah, because I don't want to Okay, Des is four. Sergeant is six. Captain is five. Axel and Stan are nine. Very good, very good. We are stacking dice, right. Axel. You and me are stacking dice. Today. All right. So, oh, I almost forgot. We have to do buddies and, and rivals. Buddies and rivals. Uh, let's start with the captain. Um, my buddy today is going to be, uh, I believe, Axel again. And my rival... Who's the first? I think it's going to be uh, Mr. Bruce Gaskin. The private? I'm the rival? Alright. Private. Now you think me personally? <laughs> I saw him going into the ventilation shaft messing around with my ship. Oh, jeez. Are you serious? Alright. Uh, Felix. Who's your buddy? Who's your rival? Um... Okay, I'm, I'm sticking with the captain, and um, it's a coin toss between the doc, he gave me medicine, I'm, I'm just going to still stick with Axel, um, since I can't get over him looting bodies. Okay. Axel? My buddy will be Captain Tiber. And 
My rival. Yeah, let's let's do it back to him. I'll do uh okay. Stan Crantham. It's a dangerous room to be locked in. What are y'all <laughs> What are y'all gonna do when Stan's dead? <laughs> Who's gonna be your rival? <laughs> where's your where's your rival now? Yeah, he's the hate glue that keeps this ship together. All right. Uh, what about Tevi Fonda? You already know my good buddy lying up, almost dead. Hoopy right behind me, and then that smarmy fuck Stan Crantham. <laughs> Not to be confused with Cran Stantham. He's a stand-up gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, Sergeant, who's your buddy? Who's your rival? I'm gonna stick with Dez as my buddy, and I'm gonna have uh, Axel as my my not friend, my rival, my okay. bane of my existence this week. All right, Armageddon. <laughs> um. I think it's still going to be my buddy's Venter because uh, of the shenanigans we're going through. And I'm going to be pissed with the engineer. Engineer's dead. Uh, I believe that. She's <laughs> beyond. How dare he be dead? He has a job to Jeff's do. Jeff's on you. He gets an XP at the end of this one then. <laughs> you can sleep when you're dead. Sure. Bye, <laughs> Thanks. Um, I don't know. Next up would be, I don't know. I guess the captain. <clears throat> with how, how dumb this ship is designed. Okay. Like, <laughs> I, dude, my, I gotta play to my character's intelligence here. <laughs> um, <laughs> Corporal Dez. Characters. All right. Uh, still sticking with uh, the good sergeant as uh, my ally. Uh, however, I'm a bit annoyed by the lack of information we're getting from the good captain. So, uh, Tiber is going to be my rival for this week. Okay. And private. Damn, airlock that. <laughs> Marines are taking over soon. Buddy is still Armageddon, and rival is still uh, Chloe, the the convict, con, the unknown NPC. Okay. All right. I can't pick. I can't pick uh, Newt, Wormy, Gringrich, Gringrich, Gingrich, the the, no. the alien as Cannot. my rival, right? <clears throat> All right. So, um, Dez. Uh, you, uh, were, you know, you and the, and the captain were kind of ransacking the area. You marked it right. clear. You guys are working your way back and you start to hear some scuffling going on at the very front of that, uh, that deck that you're on. All right. Hearing that, I'm, I'm just going to turn in, uh, 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 Armageddon? Private Venta, are you all right? Can yeah, I, you guys can have we hear your head cams on through the, the door? Or your head, head uh, units on? No, we're not fucking all right! There's a fucking disgusting thing in here with us! Oh, I am too stressed and too panicked to respond. Uh, I'm just like, yeah! Uh, uh, here, what are all these yeah, goddamn yeah, shenanigans? Get the fucking door open! Right, and uh, on that, uh, Daz is going to try to get the door open. All right. Can I uh, uh, take an action? Uh, yours will come in just a second. Okay, just let me know yep. whenever I can. All right, um, Dez. So I believe, um, let's see here, a listing of actions. What page is that on? I always lose it. Got too many bookmarks. Eighty-eight. <laughs> so student loan debt. <laughs> all right, so all right, so fast action is getting up to where you need to go, uh, and then you can do um, 
a slow action, which is roll a com tech to see if you can get the door open. Ooh. I am a zero on that one. But let's give it a go. You never know. Uh, no <laughs> modifiers, correct? No one modifiers. Point. No modifiers. Sent. One oh, success. You got it. All right, so you get in there. Uh, for whatever reason, your side of the door seems to be working fine. You uh, hit the button, and the door flies open, and you see uh, <laughs> you see Private sitting there with this the big pink worm track. thing, like, flopping around and trying to get in, and uh, Ermageddon is sitting there with these, these hedge clippers trying to chop it and keeps missing. But that will conclude uh, your action. Oh. <laughs> All right. So, so is this instead of go tell the midwife? It's go tell the moil. I'm gonna switch to um the captain and the pilot uh and Stan Crantham in the uh in the uh, bridge of the ship. You guys have locked yourselves in, but you do hear commotion going on above you, and you can see the uh, on the video feed. That's just above the door leading into the uh, ventilation room. This uh, struggle that is going on with this uh, this disgusting worm thing. So Tiber, you have an action. I would like to remotely lock I would like to remotely lock down the doors. All of doors? The ship. All doors. All right. The ship. Roll me uh, roll me a contact. You should have a success from my previous. Yeah, I have a I have a contact dice right. from Axel. So I think it gives you an extra dice, right? Uh, or is it an automatic success? Oh, do I, is it? Uh, is it contact bonus roll? It was from, from an extraordinary feat or something. I had multiple successes. Mm -hmm. I think it gave him a success for it. Yeah, it's a plus one modification to their skill roll. Yep. So, plus one yeah. on the modifier. All right, it does not work. You can push if you want to do a stress. If you want to increase the stress. All yeah, right, I'll push. Go ahead and reroll. Can I assist him? Uh, he succeeds. So, um... You, you're able to go to shut all the doors. Uh, go ahead and increase your stress and then roll me a panic roll. Seven. Seven. All right. A nervous twitch. Your stress level and the stress for the level of all friendly PCs in short range of you increase by one. Except for Axel, who does not get affected. <clears throat> oh, so, so it's just mine goes up now. There's uh, and plus Stan one Grantham's. Yeah. Yep. Was Stan in here with us? Oh. Yep, just over in the corner, watching the watching the monitor, <laughs> uh, starting popcorn. Oh, BG, <laughs> got a object redemption. Okay. Um. Mm. All right. <clears throat> that being what it is. Uh, you still have a uh, fast action if you want it. Uh, let me check the list of fast actions again. Have a look. <laughs> really weird thing to want, Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> really, really oddly specific thing that you want. I don't want it. I'm just saying that's what I deserve. Am I yes. here? Can you guys hear me? <laughs> yes. I got kicked out of the call. Okay. <laughs> I don't see anything anymore. Um, I don't think I'm, I don't think I need to use a fast okay. anything right now. All right, then we're gonna fast forward to um uh the private. All right, so I'm holding the, the squirmy wormy, Newt Gingrich. 
And uh, I get two actions, I guess. One, two, one fast and one short slow. And a long or action. Fast. Or two, sh two, two fast. Um, I, uh, I think I'm, I don't think I can do anything other than just try to continue to hold on to this thing until someone can do something about it. I'm going to just kind of continue to grapple it. Okay. Trust me, I'm trying. <laughs> All right, then. Ooh, he's trying. Um, Armageddon. All right, let's go for the snippings. Snips. <laughs> All right, roll your close combat. Close combat? Yep. So click that. What's my modification? Negative <laughs> stress level, right? No, you don't. Uh, I don't think you get a modification with that. I don't put negatives in there? No. Okay. Oh, I need to respond real quick. Oh. Never mind. I'm not going to respond back to video game I'm in. I'm just tired of watching my own back. I just let shit happen. <laughs> if you're there. Alright, so zero modifiers, I believe. Submit, and. There we go. Oh my god. Alright. <laughs> All right. Uh, first, add two stress to your stress level. Added. And then roll me a panic roll. Alright. And panic has... You get a negative two modifier on that. Because of your... I just clicked the panic. Okay, so it's... He's got another bunch eight. of aliens on Wait his roll again. Yeah. That can't be right. I'm literally... Ki I'm killing myself here. I feel like you should better off just stand there and hold the scissors. I thought I got, I thought I got <laughs> negative rolls with the more stress level I had. Well, it's okay. You're still keeping it together. Uh, the, what? You're keeping it No. Yeah. Because they have ne it's negative two modifier to that. So that puts you at a six. There's the steel, baby. So you're keeping it together. You managed to keep your nerves in check barely again. I don't know how. <laughs> somebody, somebody finish me off in chat. <laughs> you guys know you want to. All right, uh, Sergeant, you are up. He's got two items so, and, now. And redeemed in the, chat. Is the door is the door open or is it? Uh, closed? All the doors have slammed shut. Yep. Oh, they did. Shit. God damn it. Private, what the hell's going on in there? I don't know. I said open the fucking door. What the hell? We can't open the door. It won't open. It was just open. Yeah, it just. Uh, well, it's not now. There's constant. We're holding a goddamn thing. Screaming going on. It's disgusting. As well. Armageddon, Ventor, are you up to your your your, your stupid little shenanigans again? Oh, really I'm... can't take oh, it. it... I'm screaming like. <laughs> oh, oh, they're they're they're, they're definitely God, up the shenanigans. I'm, I'm God uh, damn uh, it! The next person, the next person who says shenanigans, getting a fucking pistol whipping. Uh, okay. Go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Can you just? Uh, again, can you just fucking stab this goddamn thing in the mouth? Oh my god, anybody! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm picturing I, this in my head. Um, I could just maybe. scream this, but it wouldn't be fun for people. I... Alright, uh, can can I, can Des and I both together try to, like, shoulder into the door to bust it open? <laughs> nope, it got closed again. No, it's the captain closed. shut all doors. He thanks to Tiber. <laughs> Oh, and locked him down. Yeah. yeah. We don't yeah, know we that, don't though. Know. That's meta. Man, I missed that. Meta, baby. This is it. 
All right. Um, like how every single time someone mentions the doors, someone plays the door <laughs> sound effect. <laughs> I'm going to see something here real quick. Oh, I'm saying you know what they stuff. say if you see something. going to say something. I'll be saying it. Now, did you see the I objects did, yep. in chat? We'll have to get to the uh, the good doctor in a, in a few minutes, or the bad doctor, I guess, depending on how you look at it. Atlas wants the wants us to charm the worm with a with a flute, and I think we can oblige. Who did the second part? Who did who got this? Who got the flute? I didn't see. That I have I have the flute. You do? Yeah. They gave it to you. I thought they gave you the other thing. Oh, I have Hoopy's flute. Yeah, but he's, you're not with us. No, exactly, yeah, it's I, I know. A different flute. They they want something that can't happen, so it's fantastic. Yeah. Unless you can run really freaking fast. Nope, God. nope. I, I don't think the doc, the good doctor's not running anywhere. <laughs> Man, I bet I bet Nat wasn't thinking about how the chat was going to totally prevent this from being a one shot. Uh, hmm. you know what? <laughs> It's okay. Challenge accepted. <laughs> it is okay. A good GM can work shot around anything. Ass is what they said. <laughs> it's <laughs> true. You are all powerful. Lonely. Why is it plural? Why do you have to have more than one? That's not. That's not good. You need to get that checked okay. out. Pretty serious. I, I. I'd rather have two than one. Would you? I mean, if it's are, are we, are we to reading? help that. We... Oh, I see what you're saying. <laughs> it's like AstraZeneca made a flute. Okay. Yeah. I get and it. And I'm going to just, God. I'm going to get all the flutes to try to keep that, keep that at bay, you know? So anyway. All right. Honey, I'm Someone sorry. Got another, another outbreak. <laughs> <laughs> uh, was there anything else the captain was doing or the sergeant was doing? Oh, I'm fine. Um, I just wanted to um, see if, if Dez and I could like, shoulder into the door and bust it open or if it's just like well it opens open. Uh, from bottom to top so shouldering is probably not going to do much because it's a you know it's a steel door so uh you're not going to buckle it by by doing that you might be able to try to get your fingers in there and lift but it's it's sealed pretty good so all right um, the short answer is no not directly Des, how, how familiar are you with ComTech? <laughs> no, at all. I got lucky the first time. Okay. Um, hmm. Would would we be aware of the fact that our weapons would or would not damage these doors? I mean, are these doors just like solid? Like, there's nothing we can do. Uh, it would take a lot. To you know, I mean, you know, if you unloaded a couple clips, you could probably get through. But uh, it would only puncture right, small right. holes. Like it wouldn't necessarily get you, you know, through it without mm -hmm. some kind of explosive. Okay, then I I will pull out my um, pulse rifle and just keep it aimed at the door and back up and advise Des to All do right. the same. All it. right. Uh, private. The Bloodburster is going for a throat bite. Um, can, can I do something to stop said throat <laughs> bite? I, I thought you could pray. <laughs> you can pray to whatever. Oh, that's right. It has to break. Been. Pray to Baba nope. Booey. Nope. Um, Erm, but he's yeah, grappled. He, said that he just did the. Uh, he said he was grappled, so he's got to break that that uh, mm -hmm. that check. Okay. Does he have to roll well, against my strength or yeah, something? Yeah. Or is that, Listen is that... to me. Yep. Got saved by Erm. <laughs> All right. Um. Let's see, my strength is a four. Uh, yeah. so he got a ten. That means anything. So he actually finally slips out, squirms out of your grip. 
Uh, but that takes his action, oh, shit. so he can't uh, actually attack you. He just kind of oh, on the floor. Goodness gracious. Oh, fuck! I dropped it! <laughs> All right, and then uh, damn rookie. we've got Axel and Stan next, so... Axel? My wife is probably so concerned upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> like, screaming. Uh, I'm going to try and keep tabs on everybody and their position based on where they're going on the security monitors. Okay. Have we seen any of Chloe? No. Is the Colonial Marshal still in the med bay? Yes. And you don't he'll feel this is really <laughs> awkward. You don't have to feel pressured to do anything. Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna monitor on on the security cameras. Okay. And uh Stan. So you'll actually see the the two Marines outside the door lining up as if they're getting ready to fire at the door. So Oh oh I I am microwave and popcorn. Oh, for this, <laughs> for this event, this is gonna be just like you know. Unfortunately. Well, you're you're eating for two now, so. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, um, um, are we, the food uh, synthesizers uh, I, in the back of the ship. So can I hear? Uh, can I? We, so we can actually see what's happening in the in the tunnel with the worm wrangling. You can't not? see in the ventilation, but the they're out of the ventilation shaft itself. They're just wrestling with it in the room. They're just rolling around with a pool noodle and some goo. Yep. Some blue goo. Um, and the other two are getting ready to shoot something. I'm gonna um I'm gonna open up the comms and and then I'm gonna uh just just tell them, you know, don't do that. Do not shoot at that door. We all hear that? Yes. I always throw it on comms, so I, I assume I don't have to roll for that. It's just a no, you don't have to roll for that. And since we don't, we don't have a direct channel, this is like pocket echo chamber in this place. Blasted over the uh, so I'm just gonna warn them off of uh, warn, warn them off of doing that. And um, let me see. Also, uh, there's no open the damn door. There's no airlock. Um, there's no way to evacuate the air in that tube, is there? Uh, not without pretty much evacuating it from the entire ship. All right, is the is the bridge is the bridge um, on its own life support, or will it go with the rest of the it ship? It go with the rest of the ship. So pretty much the only well, areas that you can directly uh, vent are the cargo mm -hmm. area and the uh, the passenger airlock. Hmm. Damn. All right. Um, now I guess I'll just so I have a better way. Um, so there's no fire suppression equipment or anything like that, like that I can just get a, you know, spray some shit. Sure. There. You can do fire suppression if you want. Um, in the vent. Yeah. Okay. I would like to do that. Um. Yeah. Uh, I'd like to do that and just to f anybody up in there. Okay. Um, it's, it's not in the vent. It's in the room with oh, us. Oh, in the room with you? Yeah. Oh, then I'm gonna. We're all out of the vents. Oh, I apologize. I just like. No, it's all, all right. right. I just thought I'd let you know. Oh, uh, thanks. Uh, so I'm just gonna like, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit the fire extinguishers and see about what um, a smoke bomb does, so that ninja dust does. Shit. All right. Um, go ahead and roll me a basic com tech for that. That should be easy enough to do, but. But it's a stressful situation, so. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, no mods, right? No mods. <laughs> we want to make sure you hit the right button, that's all. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So yeah, hold on, I'm gonna activate the controls. There. All right. Uh, so uh, you get two successes, which means that you get the option to do a uh, stunt. Uh, which, uh, as a reminder, you can give a plus one modification later to a skill roll relating to this one. Uh, you don't need to roll to out, uh, overcome the exact same challenge in the future. Uh, you can do it quickly in half the time that it would normally take. Uh, you get a new or unexpected information if you want. and uh, Or you can hide your tracks or show off. Um... Hmm. Yeah, so there wouldn't be any way I could I could um, say make sure that uh, the smoke hit or the the suppression only activated like right where the monster was. It's a small room. It's gonna hit. It's gonna hit the whole room. Oh, okay. Well, you know, it's gonna be. Oh, sorry, sorry about that. Sorry. Um, and I'm gonna I guess bank the the one success for later. Okay. If I need to manipulate environmental controls or something like that, I think. All right, very good. Uh, that's going to bring us back to Dez. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I tried to... Uh, yeah, this is the only way it can work. But uh, I'd like uh, to see if I can look around because, you know, I've heard Stan, you know, say, oh, hey, uh, you know, Marines, don't... Don't do that, it's, uh, you know, shooty shooty bad. Um, and I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna look around for a camera. Uh, yep, do I see one? See. Okay, uh, so I'm just gonna point at the door and just like motion to to open the damn thing up. Okay. Like if you don't want to, and um, well, I guess I'll yell too. Just like, hey, if you don't want us to shoot in here, then you need to open this damn door so we can save our men. And all their goddamn shenanigans! Oh, oh, someone's getting pistol whipped. Someone's getting pistol whipped. Did he succeed in getting the, the fire oh, yeah, stuff to go off? Okay, Alright, uh, Captain Tiber. You hear this over the comms. And you see Stan uh, has unleashed the fire suppressant into the room, filling it with all kinds of uh, dusty. Uh, Foamy uh, suppressant. Also, smooth jazz begins playing as their shirts cling to their <laughs> chests, <laughs> and the goop is just all over them. Rick, we're not there yet. <laughs> no, goop. That's next scene. Um, it's like a candle. <sighs> uh, can I guess I, I can, can I open that door? By itself, sure. specifically Absolutely. that door. Alright, I will specifically open that door so they can regroup with All their right. men. You... Just like just like they asked. <laughs> you any other actions for you? Um All right. no. I will tell them I will tell them that the ship's gonna remain on lockdown until we figure out what's going on. Mm -hmm. Uh the door opens up. Uh, fire suppressant uh, foam just kind of starts to spill out of the room. You see the two of them standing there, uh, covered in it. They look like the Ghostbusters after they got covered in marshmallow fluff and, uh, and in uh, the Ghostbusters movie. Um, but because there's so much of that stuff around, you can't actually see where the uh, little worm is. I lost it! I can't fucking see it! What the hell happened? Who turned on the fire shit? <laughs> um, so, yeah, Private, you're up first. Wait, whatever happened to my turn, Private? Yeah, but I didn't go after him he last did. time. No. Okay. Mm -hmm. very, uh, we'll watch. He held his grip, and then you tried to chop it. Uh... Okay. So, private. Sorry. Oh, okay. So, I'd like to, uh, since I don't know where the thing is, I'd like to get the hell out of the room and and, and push past, push into the other room, and then I'm, uh, 
going to draw my my wrench and take a defensive posture as I back into the other room. Assume it's a large wrench. So you push past the, the sergeant and the uh, corporal and, and uh, prepare your wrench for the worst. Do I, can I yeah. say some stuff too? Get the hell away from the door! We need to get. We need to. We need to back up. That thing's gonna come through the door. Try to. I don't know what it's gonna do. It's disgusting. Armageddon. Uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna back out as well and fall back behind them through the door and try to motion like, hey, we need to stand back. Like, when it comes through, we'll be ready. And here's the question I had. You gave me a pulse rifle and the incinerator. Uh, am I supposed to have the, both the rifle and the incinerator? You grabbed all your gear, so I'm assuming or that you have just... them. Okay, so I have two weapons. Okay. Um, and I'm hoping that I can drop the hedge clippers and pull out the rifle and take aim at the door while I'm okay. back. And you're out. going back behind with um, the private? Behind uh, the sergeant and cor Lance cor or Corporal? Yeah, but not in a angle where I'm standing right behind him so I can still shoot at the door and not hit them. If that makes sense. So they're not in line of sight. Yep, I got you. Okay. All right. Thank you. Now, so many juicy targets. So many juicy targets. Oh, Sergeant, you're up first. All right. I'm going to uh, take a defensive stance and just... You know, wait till I can see something. Okay. Um, I believe. Oh, oh, and, and also, um, I would like to hand my pistol to um, the private. Okay. I already have a pistol. Then why do you have a wrench? Because I'm not going to fire a gun in a spaceship. <laughs> I don't need like your pistol, Sarge. Like, you already gave me my pistol not paper back. Thin. What do you want me to do with a gun? Kill us all? He's definitely right. Well, you said something was in there, and all, there's all this white stuff coming in here. Yeah, but smash would, it. Would one of you kill Axel? Uh, no. Axel. Oh, right, because she, she, he, he's an android. They're an android. And yeah. what the hell's in there? It's this, it's a disgusting worm thing. It's the biggest disgusting worm I've ever seen. And it tried to bite my face off. And Ermageddon, you know, he helped a little bit. I, I was doing really good fine by myself, but, you know, he helped a little. And now it, 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 almost, it almost bit my throat or something. <gasps> <laughs> and he still really broke up about it. It's disgusting. It's really gross looking. I've never <laughs> seen anything like it. I mean, I've seen some nasty shit, but that, that's... No, nothing that wormy. So just for clarification, <laughs> uh, Dez and the sergeant, uh, so that one of the fast actions is aiming. So I'm assuming that's what you guys are doing. It gives you a plus two uh, modification when you're rolling your uh, ranged uh, attack. So you are aware. Sweet. Okay. Um... Does that mean I've, uh, uh sorry, I don't know. No, good. Because, uh, um, I, 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 so, it goes all the way back to my previous turn. Am I holding aim from a, a, just as my, like, my held action? Or, like, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm just trying to understand the game. So, um, as a fast action, 
what you can do is uh, there's actually, and for whatever reason, it's not listed in the fast action section, which it should be. Uh, but you have the ability to do what do its Overwatch, which means that you can not do anything but hold your action <clears throat> basically until something moves or some kind of event happens that you clarify, which I'm assuming is basically what you guys are okay. doing. Uh, okay, I, I guess in uh, the other part of that, I just wanted to clarify uh, by standing there and aiming in my then for uh, like uh, foregoing my next turn. Uh, by, by holding that? Uh, let me see like here. So, no, because it uses your last question. action. It's kind of, it's like a holding your okay. action, but not really holding it. It's holding it for a specific thing. But if that specific thing doesn't happen, then you lose it. Cool. All right. All right. Sorry. Yeah, I don't know why they don't have that listed in the, um, uh, in the actual list of, uh, fast actions, but it should be. Assume Overwatch yeah. position because it says specifically as a fast action you can assume Overwatch position. <laughs> so it's like okay, man. Atlas and VG are lethal oh, yeah. tonight. They're killing now. I think they're going to kill all of us, <laughs> except for me. They want the one person who's been <laughs> begging for death this entire stream. They're going to try to keep me alive for as long as possible and yep. kill all of you. It's well, going to be a ship kind of, of just you, me. though, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it kind of is. <laughs> Never say I'm you surprised. want something online, because you'll get the exact opposite. I'm just surprised I'm not the first one that's yep. died. With me always getting the <laughs> negative shenanigans. You better watch out, you're getting pistol whipped, son. Yeah, I said shenanigans again, too. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, God. from the foam, darts out uh, our little uh, space demon. Uh, so, you do have the opportunity, uh, Dez and um, Sergeant, to uh, take your shots. Okay. Don't miss. Let's do it. <laughs> God. <laughs> Oh, Perfect man. time for a glitch. Wait, is that the only thing he has opportunity yeah. to do? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Sounds like a no-brainer. So, why not just uh, be under attack? Yeah, go ahead and roll that. Uh, that sh I think that should do it. it. Should add all your stuff together that you would. that's relevant to it. And... I, you said I get a plus two. Um, Ooh. Well, you could either aim or do the Overwatch. Chat, chat just blew it up. Yeah, uh, we've got a skill drop Matt, for Wildstar, and I'm assuming a glitch oh. for Wildstar as well. I'm, I'm assuming for they haven't weapon. specified. I'm assuming. For his but weapon, I'm assuming. They haven't said who, but it's presumed, oh, given the timing. No. Oh no, yeah. it's Erm Slayer. Oh, for Erm Slayer, Erm Slayer's for getting reason. the glitch. Oh, <laughs> skill drop for Wildstar, glitch for uh, Erm Slayer. There you go. Brutal. So much chaos. And the antidote the for Tevi Fonda. Woohoo! Oh, dude, we can buy followers, primes, and viewers, guys. <laughs> oh, shit. Bye! Bye! Uh, <laughs> can we get Tesla, right, too? So... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> so, so then what? Is it a minus one instead of a minus two? Is that how the skill drop um... works? Um... Yes. Yes. Yep. So just plus one then. Okay, zero successes. Uh, Des? Oh, no. All right. Day I've been waiting for. Always wanted to shoot a slimy worm. Shoot her! Shoot her! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! That's okay. Okay. Let's start with Dez. All right. Uh, so you get uh, three successes, which allows you... Um, two stunts. <laughs> 
So, uh, let's see. Uh, some of the options here are uh, you can inflict one additional point of damage for each uh, additional success. Um, you can pin down the enemy. Uh, let's see. Which means that they miss their next slow action. Uh, you position yourself and get to exchange your initiative score with your enemy if you want. Which is not helpful for you. Uh, you can target, or your target drops a weapon, which it doesn't have. Uh, so that's not useful. It just makes all its <laughs> Yeah. Uh... Your opponent falls to the ground or is pushed back. So, like, if you're going to shut the door, like, push it back and shut the door so it's locked in there, you could do something like that. Uh, no, no. Uh, if that's all of them, then I think I have my mm -hmm. mind made up. Um, I'm going to use the additional two to inflict uh, two more points of damage. Okay. Um, let's see here. See what the one thing I gotta double check here. <coughs> Oh my. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> ah, okay. All right. Uh you fire at this thing. Uh you do hit uh but it's uh it seems to that the uh natural armor of this thing has uh Pretty much deflected your attack. Oh, uh, <laughs> uh, I, I hit that thing pretty spot on. Uh, maybe we close the door. <laughs> Sorry, you guys request those doors be locked open. <laughs> Shame. Yeah. Um. Let me see for the other, for the captain here, and is uh, firing his uh, armor-piercing rounds. Not armor-piercing enough, it seems. Well, the, that was the uh, the, uh, the corporal. The captain's got armor-piercing <laughs> rounds, but missed. So. You mean the sergeant? I'm sorry, the sergeant. Yeah. Too many ranks. All right. Uh, <clears throat> For now. All right. So the uh, the firing of your pulse rifle uh, hits uh, the the outer hull wall in the, uh, the ventilation room, and uh, the the ship lurches. Uh, the lights flicker for a second. Because this is 80s technology, and apparently everything's connected. And <laughs> uh, <laughs> the uh, cabin starts to, or it starts to decompress. Y'all are gonna get really thin <laughs> and extruded 
in a really quick way. No, you guys are, are feeling yourselves being pulled into the room. Slowly. Um, and my turn's over, so I can't do anything Correct. at this point, right? You can die. All right. Yeah, yeah. I mean, there's nothing I can <laughs> I can do in action. So. Um, I wasn't expecting decompression, so let me see if they have something for that. I like the idea that on the outside of the ship, right, there's just a shot of white foam just spewing yeah. out the side of the ship. <laughs> Like, it's just you know, it's oozing <laughs> right out. The money, literally the money shot. <laughs> and there's our cum reference. It just, it just <laughs> shot a hole inside of the ship. Isn't that the front of the thing. ship, though? It so is the front of the ship. Uh, Wouldn't it know, be rabies? Sometimes they come well, out of the mouth? You're getting, um, yeah, well, no, this is more like um, when it leaks out the side, because there's just too much of it. Well, I, uh... We only use safe... We only use, um... Uh, uh... We only use the special safe things in Iowa. That's what they taught us just before our... Our health uh, professor was replaced by our priest. So I think we'll come back to the decompression stuff. Uh... <laughs> oh, wait. Explosive decompression. Firing guns inside a spacecraft is very dangerous. If a shot misses its target into in a room next to an outer bulkhead... The weapon will inflict base damage rating on the bulkhead. Okay, cool. What was your base damage rating? Two. Um. Hey, can I pull laws of physics into this real quick? No. 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 You didn't no, write the rules. You're private. You know. Well, no. Wait, you. You went to the mil you went into the military instead of school. Yeah, exactly. You're not gonna tell me a military <laughs> man knows physics. Get the fuck out of here. All right. So what kind I of redemption do we have? At the angle they're shooting at, it would actually go down into the command deck. How would you know? He missed. Instead of the outer <laughs> wall. I got a skill if drop. You shoot or got a down glitch. into the ground, like. Where the thing is. Okay. I think that was all right, the all right, all right. So yeah. since you didn't get the glitch, Sorry. I will, I will, uh, <clears throat> I'll rewind that a little bit. There's no hole breach. You do hit the hole, uh, and cause some damage there, but um, so far no breach. But since I did get the glitch, now my mind's just like, oh my god, we've got a hall breach. <laughs> we'll see what happens to you, my friend. <laughs> okay. Uh, right. It's always <laughs> in effect. Uh, all right, so the Bloodburster's turn. It was uh, it was doing a thing. Lovebuster? Bloodburster. Yes, that's that's what we retconned. We, we, we got rid of the Lovebuster, apparently. Okay, so um, it was hit, but it still uh, lashes out. Um, let's see here. And it does six base dice. <laughs> um, so it, it, it lunges. Uh, it really just got a taste for Private Venter, so it's just lashing out towards him. Uh, through the other people? Yeah, it just, like, charges through, like... <laughs> like, it's just going at it. It just loves you. It loves you. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day. I have my wrench. Can I do anything with my wrench? <laughs> not yet. Or does it only... Um, it so, uh, it does not... Uh, it does not bite you, though. It, uh, it attempts to bite your leg, but... Uh, uh, but fails as it's, as it's dashing past you. Like, past me? Yeah, okay. Past Ah, what the fuck? God damn it! Shit! <laughs> Fucking gross. All right. Um. Axel. Um, what a bunch of chaos. Yeah, I'm still gonna <laughs> hang out here. <laughs> <laughs> Still gonna watch these 
things unfold on the security monitor and wait for uh, any orders from the captain. We can't communicate with them because they didn't want to join our comm feed. And all of our comms are in here. I, I, I'm, I'm going to be just a little meta here. If you're watching the security cams, Des did motion to close the door. After you told us to open it? Stupid these soldiers can't exit their damn mind. Uh, the other thing worth noting is that um, after the fire suppression has gone off, uh, it went off in the ventilation area, so some of that stuff is actually coming down through the uh, the air vents and spitting into your, your guys' uh, room there. I'll start cleaning up. <laughs> All right. And then Stan. Stan and I'm a paper towel. There we go. Yep, yep, there you go. <laughs> um, yeah, since I accidentally uh, picked Axel's arrival, because uh, I was warming up to them, but somehow I just looked back because I forgot who I hated in this game. <laughs> um... Uh, I'm going to see, is there, because uh, I've still got an environmental thing, right? I, I've got a plus one from the environmental messing around. Yeah. All right. While Axel is over there uh, trying to clean up uh, the vent mess, um, I'm just going to, I'm just a uh, sure dick move. I'm going to just, like, activate the yellow light and have a gust of wind just, or a gust of air just, Blast out foam on her face. Maybe cover her front. Wait, say that again? Oh, I just want to basically have, um, uh, I presume Axel's wiping things up from mm -hmm. the vent, right? Okay. So I just want to basically um, make the vent blow air extra hard and smack her in the face with all the fire suppression goo. Oh, okay. So you're going to increase, increase the that. airflow. That makes sense? Yeah, increase the airflow, pie in the face. This is basically Three Stooges rules apply. Okay. Yeah, that shouldn't be uh, too it's, difficult. It's a total waste of. It's a total waste of this entire wall. Make sure. Uh, but I need to get that point of experience. Yeah, roll roll that Cobb tech. So you make sure you hit the right button. Um, well, I gotta hit the right button here too. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I don't know what that was. I got zero successes. But I had, oh, I had a plus one, though. Or is that too late? Um, go ahead and roll uh, a d6. Okay, sorry about Let's that. Go. Okay, d6 is going up. Yep, not good enough. Okay. Uh, you can push the Damn. roll if you want, but you have to increase your stress if you do it. <gasps> oh, fuck yeah. How do I do that? All right, re-roll. Uh, with the plus one, or just... Uh, yeah, yeah, with your plus one. Okay, so contact. Again, one stress. Contact. One. This is all really complicated. All right, you are successful. Uh, however, you also have to roll panic roll, because your stress increased. <laughs> yeah. One of us is dying in this room. All right, you have a nervous That's twitch. Uh, your stress level and the stress level of the other human in the room with you goes up by one. <laughs> so you do it. You're excited about it. But the chaos of what's happening starts to, uh, to grate on your own nerves. And the captains. And this the captains. It's going to be better. We're all going to be. We're all going to be. <laughs> now your room's filling room with fire suppressant. <laughs> oh, even better. All right, Doctor Tevi Fonda, roll me. Uh, roll me your initiative. Roll for Anish. Eight. All right. Very good. I'm going to start getting you uh, a little more involved here. 
All right, the marshal. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure Chad's gonna be very upset. <laughs> the marshal uh, is starting to freak out a little bit. Uh, all the doors are locked. There's nowhere you guys can go. Uh, he's kind of going over and being like, "What the hell?" And he starts like banging on the door uh, to like the uh, the uh, uh, engineer room uh, behind you guys. Um, but that's about it for him. Uh, my good marshal, you might want to calm down a little bit. I don't think, uh, I don't think you should be, uh, overexerting yourself in, in your condition, quite frankly. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, did I say, I, I, I said too much. Yeah. So, uh, that's alarming to him. I might have to have him do a panic roll uh, just to, uh, just for the sake of checking it out. When when Tevi Fonda starts to feel ill, he just wants to bring the world down around him. <laughs> the world needs to burn. And Tevi is cursed oh, to be the one. last man to walk upon the earth. Yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and increase his stress level <laughs> for that actually. I mean, so all of this commotion and stuff going on, do do we hear any of that? Is that coming through the comms? You've heard everything in, going on in, in the here. comms, which is why I'm inviting <laughs> you guys now to participate in what's happening in this round. I would like I would like to go over to the comms and just like ship wide go, what kind of shenanigans are going on up there? This is getting ridiculous. <laughs> I have a headache. All right. Um from the uh, from the bed in quarantine, Hoopy is laying there and uh, begins to start coughing up blood. Oh! Yeah. He said shenanigans. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, I'm gonna go, uh, Marshall, my 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 dear good Marshall, would you do me a Good favor and go over there and collect me a sample of that uh, that black bile spewing out of my dear friend Hoopy's mouth. Hell mountain. no, I'm not touching any of that. <laughs> <laughs> I, that's fine. I guess we're all going to die then. All right. Uh, back to Corporal Dez. Oh, God damn it. Uh, so at this point, he's pretty frustrated. The door has yet to close. Uh, are the uh, controls for the door uh, still accessible? Yep. That I was able to open with uh, the last time. Yeah, I'm gonna go uh, hit that con uh, control panel again and close it, or at least. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you don't have to roll again for that. You should be able to close it at this point. Cool. You're familiar enough with that system. All right. <laughs> so that would be your one of fast action there. Ugh. Ugh. What? What the hell was that? Sergeant, I've never seen anything like It's still like in the room it. with you, by the way. It, it jumped <laughs> past you guys and went right for a private venter. After... Oh, fuckberries! <laughs> Why am I not paying attention? Probably because, you know, I, well, I'll blame chat like everyone Chat else. is really <laughs> lively tonight. Right. Fuck it. So, Thanks. I don't, I, I don't close the door, okay. so. <laughs> uh... <laughs> <laughs> um... At this point, and seeing such a <clears throat> trained uh, rifleman like Sergeant misses shots, uh, it, and if this is impossible, tell me. But uh, Dez is going to flip the safety on his gun, uh, uh, flip the barrel over into his hand. He's going to uh, try and pistol whip uh, mm -hmm. the bloodburster. Okay. It's such shenanigans. All right, so that'll be... Um... You want this? That's gonna be more of a hand-to-hand -hand thing since you're you're getting close, mm -hmm. or close combat rather. So close combat. Uh, game. Thank you. Zero success. All right. So uh, you attempt, but uh, but uh, not quite get there. Oi! He's a slippery little fucker. Um, that'll bring us to the sergeant. 
I'm going to uh, attempt to do the same thing, smash it with my rifle. All right. Roll close combat. I'm sorry. Can I ask a question? Sure. Is the uh, little serpent thing still in the vent room, or did nope. he go past them, past our characters? Past your characters. Okay. I wasn't sure because the uh, models show differently. No, it doesn't. I... Oh, hey. No, it doesn't anymore. <laughs> uh, it was up until no. just now. Frozen I'm sorry about that. The... That's good. Thank yeah. you. To be fair. So I got one success. Uh, All right. Bullseye. All right, so for that, you're able to hit it. Uh, it's going to be basically up Hell to one yeah. object. Let's see how much damage that's going to do. I believe it's going to do one point of damage. He didn't get a stunt, so it's basically going the uh, the armor uh, on this thing is is it's when you hit it, it looks slimy and like pliable, but when you hit it, you you feel it's hard. It is hard as shit. Oh man, there's so many mom jokes right now. <laughs> All right, um, Private Venter. It lacks you. It went past. It did me, go though. past you. On to, to brighter pastures. Well, all the doors are locked, so it can did only go where, where the bunks are. Did I see where it oh, went? Oh yeah, yeah. Where where did it go? Uh, it's right behind you. Everybody's coming up and trying to hit it with it, their pistols. It... Everybody's like trying to smash this thing. From behind me yep. now. And the sergeant got a good hit on it, but they just kind of looked at him and smiled. That's disgusting. <laughs> and so, is it? It's going away from me, or did it turn around to face us? Uh, at this point, it had just passed you. So, oh, heading away yes. from me. It's not turning around or slowing down. Got it. I okay. tried to swipe you as it went by. Oh gosh! And it's out of reach nope. now. Nope. Still with engaged range. I think it's out of character for me to do anything other than um, step back and take a defensive posture. No, grapple it again. <laughs> yeah. I, part of me, so meta, part of me thought I, I, I should do that, but that thing almost. Yeah, no, you should be yeah. stepping back. My character sh yeah. has no interest in touching it again. And it's targeting um, you too, so <laughs> it's even more terrifying. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm, um, I'm going to step back with the rest of the group with my wrench defensively and say, Jesus Christ, stop shooting at it. Grab something, something to smash it with. I'll, I'll <laughs> let him go through me and step in front of him if I can. You want to step in front of him? Uh, if, if he's moving back, I'm not going to be in his way. I'm going to do like a quick side step out of his way so he can move through. And Yeah, I'd like to be in that corner. On, on the ship, the corner that's unoccupied. Away from the on disgusting the worm thing. Um, okay. Like, all right. So basically. Yep, that's it. Whoa. whoa, whoa. I'm closer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, you said you wanted to step uh, in front of him. Just wants to exchange yeah, not positions. Not step in front of him. Just yeah. let him pass. Like, move out of his way. Okay. But it, if that forces me to step in front of him, that's fine as well. I'll go for it. I'll... There we go. Now, we can assume that we can push Pat. We can go through each other yeah. without any concept, without having to coordinate. I'm assuming that, right? you guys are working together because you're a squad. Right. And nobody's, uh, you know, if somebody wants to stop somebody, then we would do something different. So sure. Anybody can chime in on that. But, um, 
Yeah, so the, so the reason I moved the the sergeant forward is because they were pistol whip, actively pistol whipping it. So, unless you want to move forward, sure. uh, Armageddon, then I'll just have you just let him get past him. It is. Now, I'm going to pull out the small Molotov cocktail I have and light on fire and toss it at him. Okay, roll me a ranged... It's like right in front of him. I just roll him a drop. drop <laughs> yeah, it. right. Hey, hey, with how I've been rolling, you never know. Like, That's true. Why don't you throw it at one of your buddies and then see what happens? Oh my god, three successes. Woo! Woo! All right. Um, I like the idea you're throwing this in some place that's about the size of a bathroom. Three successes. Okay, so... <laughs> Uh, a little, they were, you're a little meta here. Uh, so this thing has, uh, in the past, you, you know that, uh, three damage has been, uh, what its armor usually absorbs. However, they are susceptible to fire. So your cocktail here. Let me make it simple to you. Yep. Any bonus hit? Is going to go to damage and killing it. <laughs> okay. If if that makes it simple. It does. Uh, the only thing I got to see is the effect of the fire on the ship itself. So I got to find out how much this uh, fire does here. Where is your incinerator? Well, the help, it? It, is the fire going to do much with the? Flame suppression stuff all over. The place. Uh, so that no. was mostly in the other room. Yeah, yeah, I was wondering about that. Um, if because also it has to like um, one to us. Not it has anything. to land on the fire. I would guess. Yeah, some poured out the door when you opened the door, but it already did its thing in the other room. It already blew its load. All right, let's see here. Fire, 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 fire. And I said a small Molotov. So it was like a, like a mason jar? <laughs> a juice. Yeah, no, a juice box. He has a juice box. I, I would imagine more center. so like a juice box, honestly. <laughs> a juice box or a flask. But it would be like oh, a glass. Oh, I like a flask. But yeah. um, again, like, you can't just randomly hide a mason jar on you. It's got to be something that, like, you hi you can hide on you, you know. Well, I can't just um, be like, oh, here's think, a fucking baseball bat. You kept that baseball bat yeah. up his yeah. butt. I got lucky yeah. with the hedge clippers that, you know, I was hiding in my boots somehow. All I'm going to say is I have seen people um, put mason jars in some very interesting places at the state fair. I don't want to know. But thank you <laughs> no, for No, you really don't. <laughs> state fair to you to well the butter cow is not the well the iowa state fair of course okay um oh, of course All right. yeah. so, so it does there. kill uh your little friend he's not our friend pal <laughs> i'm not your pal friends i'm not your buddy pal um i'm not your pal but it guy. does it does have a small <laughs> fire going there it can be put out with a mobility check <laughs> A successful mobility check. <laughs> I say nobody should do that. Um. And Sergeant, you're up next. Oh no, wait, you did, Sergeant. Uh, da, 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 where it is? Uh, actually, it's back to the doctor's actual actions. So. Um. Yeah. What are you, what are you doing there, Doctor? I guess I'll go. I'll go look at uh, uh, Hoopy and see if there's anything I can do for him. Uh, again, his life signs are, are becoming very weak and erratic. Um, he is in quarantine, so he's fully boxed in there. Mm -hmm. Hoop, Hoopy, Hoopy, can you hear me? Can you? What? What would you like me to do? Uh, he tries to say some stuff, but he just coughs up some more blood. 
do you do you want me to end this for you? Are you suffering? <laughs> Uh, let's see here. Kick, kick the containment one time for yes, please kill me, and twice for no, I wish uh, to live. He kicks it one time. Uh, I'm gonna look around and see if there's anything I can use to to put him out of his misery. Um, humanely, not humanely. So he's in, in the medical uh, system. There, you could actually use it to uh, inject him with some kind of drugs. That would uh, be a lethal dosage. Perfect, perfect. Are there any any of them the fun yeah, drugs? Yeah, there'll be some in there. I'm gonna I'm gonna use I'm gonna use one of those. I want his last few moments to at least be pleasurable before he ODs okay. and dies. All right, you uh, you inject him. I'm sending you to the great Baba Booey in the sky, my friend. I'll see you soon, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully, he says. Um, as you walk... Kill me. They're going to write my name in papers, I swear. Um, as you walk over to the uh, panel, uh, you kick some other item that was kind of sitting there on the ground. Must have fallen when the, the ship... Uh, it was uh, going through that, uh, yeah, lurching mm -hmm. earlier. Oh, what is it now that I see again? Uh, it's another time? flute. Oh, wonderful! I pick it up and I um um. I I start trying to play taps, but I don't know how to play taps, so it sounds really bad. You're gonna Kenny G this guy to death, aren't you? That's fucking music to my ears. So as you're playing that, uh, this thing bursts out of Hoopy's chest. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> let me let me play that in reverse. Maybe he'll go back. <laughs> uh, it, it, go back. It looks like it's dancing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this what is great. <laughs> Marshall, get over here! Get over here! Dance with it! Dance with Dance it! Dance with what? Hello, my honey. Hello, my Hello, my Hello, my <laughs> The doctor is starting to lose his, his faculties, I think. All right. <laughs> we'll come back to that. Uh, I do believe I actually skipped the captain. So, uh, the captain, you're up next. <sighs> um... <laughs> Part of your ship's on fire over by the beds. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the one the room's filled with off. fire suppressant, uh, which is leaking into your room. And the doctors are now dancing around uh, a dead hoopy in the medical bay, playing a flute. <laughs> Getting our safety deposit back. Yeah. All things seem fine then. <laughs> Just, just a normal day on your ship. I'm just saying that the cleaning deposit, you're right, Cap, the cleaning deposit is gone. <laughs> uh, it's, we're just, just going to make that pay for it. Yeah. Uh, oh. oh, and I'm going to need the doctor to roll a uh, panic roll, too. Okay. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Four. All right. You're okay for now. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, you are a lot. Jeez. Well, I guess I should take listen to what Corporal, Corporal uh, Dez told me to do and shut the door now. Mm. All right. So all doors are now shut again. <laughs> 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 is the camera still stuck on the top floor or are we on the middle floor? Uh, I still have you guys on the top floor. That's where that's where most of the action is going on. Sorry. If wait, if he closed all the doors, then that means it's in it's, it's in now. there with us. It's, it's oh, leaping no. ball <laughs> flames. But the fire's in there with you. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you guys it's killed it? But it's also extra crispy, so you know we're fine. Uh -oh. It's oh, overcooked. Yeah, Send it back. I asked for medium rare. <laughs> 
This isn't Dendy's. Dendy's. We, Den we don't, we don't this that. isn't Dendy's. <laughs> Never been to Dendy's Damn before. It. <laughs> that's that's uh, a good or, joke or in my head. Play, uh, play, uh, uh, play to chaos, uh, you know, over at Dendy's. <laughs> yeah. Chow. Ch or chow. Get some chow Going at Dendy's. Dendy's. Hey, I'm oh. going to use my banter oh. here and be like, <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I may have overcooked it. <laughs> yes! Can we can we reduce <laughs> to stress now? <laughs> uh, the people in that room, yes. Oh my gosh! Oh my cool. god, it worked! It, my guys yeah, go. It, <laughs> it, 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 it takes a, like a while, so like this is something you're gonna have to do over like time. It's not a short action or whatever. So. so um, real quick, before we uh, get to experience, uh, I'm going to run through and we're going to talk about what's going to happen, what, what you want to accomplish over the next uh, like 10, 15 minutes of time. So uh, we'll, we'll start, we'll keep going in the order that we've gone through um, now that combat is over. Uh, actually, I'll do it by room. I'll do it by room. So, uh, the Marines... What is your next plans of action? So my thought is we're in a room with both doors shut and locked. And the hatch going down is also shut. The dead. Okay. Yeah, so we're, we're going to see it's the dead. kill this thing. Yeah. Well, it's already dead, right? Did, oh, yeah, it is dead. It's just, yeah, uh, I missed that too. I, I don't know how I missed it. Probably because I was engrossed in chat. But the um, room is on fire. <laughs> so it's dead as fuck. Yes. You were being gross oh, in chat. Oh, the room's on 100%. fire. Gross in chat. <laughs> so, yeah. we're going to need to get spray? out of the room. Okay. Yeah. Or um, com communicate with the captain. Tell him to put on, like, sinklers or something. Turn on the anti... The, he, already, he already blew that load, room. though, didn't he? With the anti... <laughs> that was the other room. Yeah. Oh, it was only on the other yeah. room? Okay. So, yeah, I, I think... Yeah. Sounds... Well, if, if the sergeant's going to call for that, we're all obviously... Probably just gonna let be uh, quiet. Enjoy while the he talks. banter of Armageddon. Yeah, we'll, we'll laugh at his banter, and then defer to okay. the sergeant. Unless you guys have something else you want to do. Every single time someone says Armageddon, all I want to do is listen to uh, uh, fucking. I don't want to miss a thing. <laughs> it just starts playing in my head. Yeah. Don't want to close Bye. the windows. Don't want to fall that? asleep because aliens will eat my ass. <laughs> that was nice. Ask him for desire. Who wanted okay. that in chat? I got gotcha. you. All right, uh, Captain and uh, Stan and a Axel. We'll go to you guys next. Okay, so doors are sealed, right? Doors are sealed. They've asked to either open the doors so they can get out, or use the fire suppressant to put the fire out. That is burning your beds. Well, it's, it's, you know, Cap, no air puts out a fire. Can we, is there a way to vent that room? Well, we could just, like, turn off the oxygen, or... Now that it's sealed, yes, you could turn off the oxygen more. just to that area. Yeah, yeah I can, I can reverse the doors you... and, um, I'll re reroute the ODN conduit to the lateral buffers nice. or some shit like that how do, how do you sleep when your beds are burning <laughs> oh, oh oh come on i think it's time to say fair's fair <laughs> we've had enough of this we've had our share um <laughs> that's, that's my thought is uh they don't need air well they want the fire out so we'll take care of that I'm sure they have. I'm sure they brought their, you know, air, air, extra air with them. They're prepared for everything. They're Marines. Make it happen. Canned, they have canned air. Oxygen is for well, uh... wimps. All right. Um. So yeah. Uh. If no one's really stopping me, I'm gonna look around. <laughs> you know. Well. Okay. And I'm gonna um. Uh. Attempt to like remove oxygen. I'll, I'll tell, put it this way. If you want to press the button, I'm not gonna stop you. <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm on the fence. More oxygen or less oxygen? I think less oxygen will. 
No idea how long that will take. All right. But I'll do that. <clears throat> Next 15 minutes, I'm going to suffocate the Marines. Now, Meta, Axel, being a uh, synthetic, uh, you will have issue with allowing harm to be come to humans. Even though uh, I don't humans. know what he's doing. I'm cleaning. <laughs> well, he just had the conversation <laughs> in front of you. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, we did. Yeah, we kind of mentioned it. it. Sounds like he's gonna take care of the fire. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Screw you, Asimov. <laughs> All right, and then um, Asimov. doctor. Yes. Uh, what what's uh, your intentions over the uh, next uh, few minutes? Um, the up, the the player is actively trying to uh, uh, get the character killed by this chest burster, but I'm sure Tevi Fonda is going to do everything in his power to not have mm -hmm. another alien baby inside okay. of him. Um. <laughs> So I do believe we have uh, another redemption that we have to account for. So you look over at the terminal uh, that has been holding um, uh, Hoopy in it. And uh, you see some words flashing up, you know, in the, in the little one at a time letters that come up in, in, in aliens type or 80s, 80s uh, technology type. And uh, you just happen to catch the word um, antidote. Potential antidote. Hmm. Well, I'm absolutely going to dig deep into this. It's basically like, as you look a little closer, it's going to be like an, an analysis sheet that basically kind of tells you mm -hmm. what mm -hmm. it believes would would uh, combat this. Uh, it, it's a shame that there's a dancing worm real close to that. So it's, it's, we'll and see if I get You feel a very strong uh, burning sensation in your chest. Like, mm. a, like a really bad heartburn. Probably nothing. Tacos. Tacos, man. I'm going to pop. I'm going to pop another never sleep pill. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh, I wonder what happens if I take a, na a never sleep and a nap relieve. Will they cancel each other out? You know what? The doctor's going to do it. We're going to find out. Okay. We're going to find out. Um, That's interesting, actually. Let me see. I want to resolve this. <laughs> <laughs> Where are the drugs? Where are the, the drugs, man? Of the, night. the most compelling thing of the night is, is somebody taking a Valium. And their their ADHD meds at the or at the same time. It's like if you put a dehumidifier and a humidifier right next to each other. Okay, I so want to yeah, see what happens. You have to increase your stress level. level. Okay, stress level going up. That 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 makes a it panic make roll. A panic correct. Roll. I have to do a panic roll. Four again. Four. All right, you're not Four. panicking. Sure. You're feeling pretty good. Oh. Well, that's that's <laughs> relative. That's that's real relative. All right. Um. Just taking all kinds of pills. You know, but okay. it's not going to compare the thrill you get. On the, if you're on the cover of the Rolling Stones. I'm going to get rid of that for a second. And... Yeah, we'll get rid of that. Um... All right, and uh, your body starts to kind of shut down, and the last thing that you see is your eyes go dark. Is this thing burst out from your chest onto the floor? Yes! 
Oh, no. oh, no. I feel like a proud mother. Oh, my baby. <laughs> Baba Booey would be proud. <laughs> Alright, guys. F's in the chat. You know what to do. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> experience. Let's do experience. <laughs> All right. I will remember you. All right. Experience is this page. Can I get all the stuff? Um, we'll see what happens. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Is the private going to loot him? <laughs> right. All right. Uh, did you participate in the game session? Yeah. All right. Yes. <laughs> they can't see you. You've been uh, marked off. You've been you've been static. Oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> the good doctor's leaving a, uh, a love note for everybody. It doesn't matter anymore. <laughs> Wait, I missed what happened. I, I think that was... He's dead as he fuck. Died. Yeah, what died. He died. He died. He, he just, uh, alien burst from his chest. Uh, okay, and that's when he was just like, okay. Damn. Well, I think we can put something inside of him and move him around. I mean, yeah, we could turn him into a robot. <laughs> we know Android is a thing. True. <laughs> Wrong universe. All right, did you I risk or sacrifice <laughs> something to further your personal agendas? Personal agenda. Yes. Uh, Irm, yes, okay. Really? I'll accept I, that for Irm, Armageddon. <laughs> I tried killing him again, and then <laughs> I stood in front and tossed a mini Molotov. And you know how fire is, it's unpredictable. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, I think I did as well. Well, uh, wait, I'm going to check to see what yours was real quick because I don't remember. All right, so we are talking about Captain Tiber. Um, hmm. Okay, I'll go with it. Anybody else for personal agenda points? Uh, I made fun of Axel <laughs> and I said all the white stuff. For personal, wait a minute, let me see what your personal agenda is. Making fun no, of him? That's not what, what? it is. <laughs> all right. Uh, did you risk your life for your buddy PC? I don't think I can go that far this week. Not okay. really. I'm... <laughs> For my buddy PC, though, because Wild Star was never really in danger, so... I don't know. I'm going to leave that one up to you, because... Uh, I don't know. I certainly charged in there, uh, unlike a medic. Uh, your buddy was the, the sergeant? It was. Uh, something else might apply in a minute. Um, did you challenge or stand up to your rival PC? Oh, yeah, that's what I meant for my uh, my thing about making fun yeah. of Axel. I'm sorry. I thought we were answering both of the no, same. Yeah, that one. Um, who was your uh, rival? It was Axel. Axel. Okay, and how did you stand up to them? I just made fun of him because he's an uh, angel. Okay. I like the she. Axel's actually a she, if I recall correctly. Well, it's a mm -hmm. synthetic, yeah, so... Extra upset. I tried to murder my rival. Yes. Does that count? Um... I'll do it. <laughs> Better. I mean, I, I tried to pie in the face. Oh, I tried to pie in the face, Axel, but I don't think that's, like, really standing up. That's just annoying them. Yeah. <laughs> 
I'm going to ask if uh, me pulling the trigger uh, in Captain Tiber's tip uh, ship counts. Yeah. Um, <laughs> no, because that more affects everybody, not just the captain. That wasn't something specifically against him. Yeah, but it's his ship. His name's on the lease, man. He's going to have to make a call to Geico yeah. and be like, yo. You ain't gonna believe what this asshole yeah. did on my goddamn ship. I got, I got ship insurance. Yeah, no, I think it's that's the measure of how much he hates him. He's going to kill everyone to get to him. All right, let's move on. Not buying it. Nope. Uh, did you make a panic roll? Anybody who made a panic roll? Yes. Take an experience yeah. point. Armageddon, I think you're... Do ghosts you. get experience? <laughs> no! <laughs> this is gonna be Is this the one that we get one just no, for playing? We already did that one. Yeah, if you made a panic roll. So this should be your second one. No, our oh, third one. Yeah. So I, I definitely rolled a yeah. panic roll. Oh, it's yeah. my third one? Oh, I missed one. I think you missed the participation Sorry. trophy. I did. I did. I always get the participation trophy. Well, somebody doesn't get the participation trophy. I think he's, yeah. Be yeah. I think he's beyond that though. right now. I think he's beyond caring about his XP at this point. Why would you be so rude <laughs> of the dead? <laughs> You'll join me soon, all of you. All of you all. No, Thanks, guys. Yeah. This is officially a thing. This is going to happen next time. All right. Did you overcome a dangerous event using violent or nonviolent means? Uh, I would say... Hey. The Marines all did. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We shut the doors. Uh, you know, so that's true. Doors, you guys participated. Fire suppressant. You didn't know it wasn't going to work. They fire suppress. So, I was kind of hoping that the, 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 the eel would get a little more fucked up by that. Sorry, guys. Well, it's the opposite. It, what, it's, it was submissible to fire, not, you know, fire suppressant. But it was a good try. Yeah, but that's irritating on your skin, you know? <laughs> um, the slide. Did you make a significant discovery or revelation? <laughs> the captain's down with cold blood. And <laughs> I, 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 well, that is a plot point. Uh, Des learned the hard way that those little fuckers are uh, rather bullet resistant. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and fire and uh, Arm made a, a discovery that extra deep fry is their specialty. Okay, yeah. So the three <laughs> Des I love for fry. knowing that it uh, has armor, first of all. For the sergeant yeah. for trying to hit it and realizing that the physical damage isn't uh, as effective. And then Ermadin mm -hmm. for discovering the fire is super effective. I think would all qualify. Yeah. Oh, I guess I'll gain another experience point. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Yeah. you don't have to take it. He's blushing yeah. under that beard. Yes. Don't take them for granted. One I... day you won't have any experience. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll take what I can get. <laughs> Just because the chat usually gives me all the bad stuff. You oh, still they have tried. a glitch. Chat tried their yeah. damn. There just wasn't a situation to redeem the glitch yet, so we're working on it. Yeah. It's not it hasn't gone away. I wanna see I wanna see how many XP drops I get right now. <laughs> like how fast they can drop. Let's finish uh, let's finish dishing it out. Yeah, you could. Uh did you perform <laughs> yeah. any extraordinary action of some kind? If only the doctor was alive. <laughs> yeah, his ghost is haunting chat too. Yeah. I, I, I'm just going to go as far to say I escaped the <laughs> alien. Surviving doesn't count. <laughs> I don't know if that's good enough, but I feel like that's extra extraordinary. I don't normally escape aliens. How many of you fought? I killed it. You did kill it. Do I get an XP for that? That's also extraordinary, in my opinion. But that's based on the the, st the the status quo being what was happening before the alien. True. So. True. 
Uh, I Whatever. guess uh, because it was the first kill. I'll let you have it. Nice. Yep. Are you sure? I like this lobbying <laughs> thing. Whose <laughs> idea was this? Um, and then did you earn any money? That would be Free League Publishing. <laughs> <laughs> did anybody earn any money? Nobody earned any money. So, no experience for that. All right. Um, will the, the ghost of Tevi Fonda help out with uh, talking about some upcoming stuff while I look for a raid? <laughs> we have lots of projects from the great beyond. Saturday, we have a premiere. Correct? Yes. Yep. Yep. Really? We are doing another Rifts campaign. Join what? us. What? Saturday, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to watch Session Zero of our new Rifts campaign. Cool. We, we also have maybe possibly a Sunday game coming down the road. Ooh, spooky. You hit us with a Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. <laughs> I was thinking that too. Oh, on yeah, Sunday, seriously, with the voice. Sunday, Sunday. Nice. When is that Sunday, though? Sun. What? Sunday. No, someday. You think? Maybe someday. Monday, <laughs> we have Star Trek. Ooh, spooky. <laughs> All right, please stop it. Stop, stop it. There's a ghost lamp. All <laughs> there is, that they said ghost lamp. If you all vote, somebody's going to get lucky with a candle. And then next Wednesday, we will be playing Jackbox games as our D&D Edenia campaign has shuffled off to the great beyond to join me, Dr. Tevi Fonda. Ooh. But don't worry, it will be resurrected in a few short months. Ooh. All right, we're <laughs> set with this raid. Um... Yeah, so I think there's still open casting calls for a couple games if people want to join the Discord and uh, jump in on any of them. Um, and yeah, I think I think we covered everything else, right? Yeah, we're good. We're all good. It's been fun. I promised somebody would die. <laughs> it's true. Yeah. You delivered. Yeah. Just just had that you know, press the fast forward button for a few yeah, seconds, but we right. got we'll there. Do. It'll be a nice surprise for everybody else <laughs> who doesn't realize it happened yet. <laughs> All right. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye.